to Mars. And here we go again. Scientists are have come up with yet another species that they claim we bred with a long time ago. And this is just getting wearisome as far as I'm concerned. Now, just so you know, the story originated with Washington Compost. And therefore, it's part of the mental disorder of liberalism. Because all I'll do with them is mock them. I won't use them for any news stories. Unless I'm mocking them. We rarely portray Neanderthals or close relatives as telegenic. Museum exhibits give them wild tangles of hair. And Hollywood reduces them to grunting unsophisticates. The skulls suggest broad faces, tiny chins, and jutting brows. But to mock Neanderthals is to mock ourselves. Unbelievable. Homo sapiens had lots of sex with Homo Neanderthal lenses. <laughs> Neanderthal genes supply between 1 and 4% genome in people from homelands on several continents. From Britain to Japan to Colombia. So not, now some of us are part of the Neanderthal and part others aren't. Uh, <laughs> we're all the same species, you rat. DNA from another human-like primate, the Denisovans, lurks in modern genomes, too. <laughs> Molar and a chip of... Pinky bum. <laughs> this is what they're basing this on. <laughs> Found that the Siberian cave provide what little information we have about this. <laughs> I can't. A tooth and a piece of a pinky. Whoa, yeah. I'm loving this. <laughs> DNA extracted from the. Fragments previously released revealed cross-species breeding. <laughs> what the hell? You're the, new <laughs> You're the new study in the journal Cell shows that the ancient Hanky Panky did not stop in Siberia. Humans have traveled across South Asia and made him with a separate group of Denisovans as well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm losing it. This is a breakthrough paper, said David Reich, who studies ancient DNA at Harvard University and was not involved with the study. It's a definite third interbreeding event, one that adds to the previously known Denisovan and Neanderthal mixture. <laughs> I can't deal. I'm sorry. Humans and Neanderthals divided into separate groups as far back as 760,000 years ago. Denisovans and, the <laughs> and Neanderthals were closer cousins to, cousins to split more recently and then vanished perhaps because we absorbed their lineages. <laughs> so where did we come from? Some stupid ape? <laughs> Some stupid ape called Cheddar Man? I don't think so. I don't know. A team of scientists led by <laughs> University of Washington biostatistician Sharon Browning took an approach that Wright called a technical tour de force. In a new study, Browning and her colleagues examined more than 
5,500 genomes of modern humans from Europe, Asia, and Oceania. Where is that? I've never even heard of Oceania. Looking for, except in the uh, book 1984 by George Orwell. Looking for possible archaic DNA. You don't have archaic DNA in us. We've been around a long time, you numb skulls. We're looking for segments of DNA in an individual that took quite, look quite different from the rest of the variation in the population, Browning said. As the team finished out the DNA variations, the researchers matched the segments to the Denisovan and the Andrethal sequences known from samples in the Siberia's I'll take mountains. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so far freaking precious. All the groups studied from British and Bengali people <laughs> to Peruvians and Puerto Ricans had a denser cluster that most closely matched the Atlai Altai Neanderthal. Some populations also had a cluster that matched the Altai Denisovans, which was particularly pronounced in the East Asians. I'm going to stop this right here because I'm just laughing myself silly. Yeah, I, I, even I as an agnostic, I have to admit, the Bible's explanation for how we got here is more credible than this. Unbelievable. Now they guys breeding with all sorts of different species. Uh, now, I think we were helped along. I definitely think that. By whom, I don't know. But this is why I only mock these people. I don't listen to them. This is utterly absurd. They come up with a name of an entire species based on a little piece of pinky bone and a tooth. Unreal. Cooks! I can't deal, folks. That's it. Thanks for watching. I'm Artifacts of Mars.